uh, isometric souls type game it's a uh, rpg elements and all that good stuff so let's roll with it Zombies canister. We got an inventory. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and take that overlay off because there's really no sense in having it. The temperatures are good and all that good stuff, so that way we can see the screen. Oh, we got some moves. Push down the hill. Yeah, I know the game is, you know, basic and all that good stuff, but sometimes games that look basic, they wind up just being... Basic. But this is a real early type demo. Just dropped today. Shoot. Attack. You guys, not talking about anything. The car's verge. What is that? Ooh, plus eighteen. Let's let's check it out. You gotta love those indie developers, man. Sometimes they make really good games for like on the cheap side for people that don't, you know. Sometimes you don't have a lot of money to spend and you just want to drop a little cash on a little game. It might be worth your time. Got a stamina at the top that I'm noticing in green, and looks like the uh, red is health. And it looks like there's a boss or something, or something really gross. The description of this game it says something like Morbid the Seven Acolytes is a horror punk action RPG filled with Lovecraftian horrors and Cronenbergian gore, making it the most gruesome take on the isometric Souls-like genre yet. Haven't seen any blood so much besides the little plants over there. But let's see if we can attack this thing that looks like it has a bunch of holes in it, some skulls. All right. Okay, we shot him and he looked like he puked up some blood that probably would damage you. Can I hit him from this side? Oh, oh yeah. I always gotta initiate the cheat. into that. I was trying to do my special move, but I actually rolled in there. Go ahead and 
unleash your weapon. Also, I can break the shards or whatever it is on the ground. That's a good thing. not so good with this. Like I said, it's a demo, so they can probably, you know, improve some things by the time before we come. Alright, so I killed the guy, and he... I guess it was like a little guy inside of it, or maybe it was like a storm. Flesh plant petal. Greater right on the solitude. Oh, we got some story. It was huge. Huge, I tell you. I've never seen tusks so big, nor a jaw so strong. It mashed our wagon like tater, with the driver still on his seat. <laughs> it walked on all fours, but had human hands, and the fair was infested with flesh plants. All the eyes deep inside the skull, glowing red dots, burning in the night like the embers of fire. Did I just kill that? Burr, gives me the shivers to even think of him. This all happened northeast of Grimwald's Grove. I managed to escape. The others weren't so lucky. So northeast will be up. So I guess what I just killed wasn't what he's talking about. We were on our way to deliver arms and goods to this village, this here village, but got left behind too. So if anyone's brave enough to fetch them, go right ahead, they're all yours. Just bring me back my bottle if you find it. I could use a stiff drink right now. So it does have a little story in the demo. I want to see what that is. There. Oh, that was cheap. Since we have, we don't have an unlimited supply of bullets, just trying to hit them at an angle so they hit two at the same time. What's this? Do we have any refill of bullets? Okay, right here. Equip. Okay. Easy enough. Picked up lightning shroom. You know, usually there's always something in these boxes and you know barrels, always hiding. Can I talk to you? Nope. But we got an axe. Up 35. Let's go ahead and equip that. And it looks like some little uh, little holes on it. Maybe we can imbue the thing. What does this do? Let's inspect. One of the enchanted runes of anger, forged by the ferocious god Balgar, at fire to a weapon. Okay. And for some reason it dropped out. And 
And this one does what? Add fire to a weapon. So since we since we already have fire, is there anything else? What is this 10% and 15%? Electricity? I love that. Add cold to a weapon. Cold or electricity? You know, maybe sometimes cold will actually freeze a creature. So let's do that. Buster Sword. Sword of the Brom. How strong is it? Well, not stronger than what we got. But it looks like it'll be a little, like 10% faster. I think that 100% there with the sword uh, with some lines on it. I think that might be quickness on how fast you can swing it around. Not sure. Okay, so let's check. Make sure. We're not missing anything. Yeah, that's a dead end. And we came from up down here, right? Did we, did we talk to that guy? Probably not. We can't talk to him, but he's a big dude. It looks like somebody that, um, like a weapons maker or something. He might be one of those types. Hold on. Oh no. I think we might be going too far up. a different type of creature this is a single player game only how's it going fxdy this is just a little demo i'm checking out of a game probably going to release sometime maybe in the next month or so might even be this month i'm not sure but I saw it on Steam and just decided to get it and try it out. Make sure we check. Oh, what is that? care of that. It looks like we can go down here, but I want to check on the cross just to make sure. So you can parry. Just just like that. Picked up genetically modified broccoli. Ah, uh, so 
Max Kanar, he says, hello, I bought Acer Nitro 5, uh, the 10th gen with the 8 gigabytes of RAM and GTX 1650 Ti. But RAM frequency is 2933. Do you know what RAM would work in dual channel? If you look on my channel for a RAM installation video, the RAM I have listed in the description is the one you can use. Oh, the game is very loud? Okay, let me turn it down. I don't know what's up with all these games being so darn loud. How about that? Is that better? So there's a pig laying down in the mud. Not much going on going on with him and it looked look like he's tired look like he'd been abused or something Rombie's canister Trusty blaster. Is that a gun? Inspect. The trusty blaster. Alright. They'll probably they may change some of this text when the full version comes out. I'm not sure. But it looks like it's not as strong as the weapon that I have. Alright, thanks man. Appreciate it. So, FXDY wants to know any tips to get stable frame rates in Fortnite? How do you. <laughs> how to play stable with 144 FPS? I want a 1050. You're not gonna do it, man. It's not even possible. The only way you might be able to get 144 is if you drop your resolution down. If I was you, I would start at 720, maybe low settings, and work from there on the way up. But 144 FPS on a 1050, man, I don't... Nah, man. And you might not really see, uh, you know... I'm, I know you want to get 144 FPS, but you might not be able to tell uh, depending on what type of monitor you're playing on. Like if you have a 60 hertz or 120 hertz. I mean, sometimes it's almost better. I mean, if you have a 60 hertz panel, sometimes it's almost better if you just sync up with the panel. And it'll, it'll play just fine, dude. It'll look real clear and crisp. You're playing on 240 hertz. Are oh, you welcome, FSDY? Yeah, you know, if you're playing on a 240 hertz and you're, you know, trying to run it with a 1050, I don't think you're gonna make it, man. Really, it's just, it's just not powerful enough to push that type of frame. <laughs> I mean, on a game something like this, you could, but, you know, do you really need it? Nope. But on a game such as Fortnite, um, nah, it's not gonna happen, dude. Woo, almost got slapped. So let's go on back to the top where we were headed. Because I think I cleared out everything here. I think it was around this way. 
pretty sure it was around this way. Oh, not this way. All right, here we go. Yeah, one of these guys again. Man, that delay. I want stable FPS at 144 FPS. What kinds of build do I need? Are you building a desktop? Well, the first thing you need to find is if, you, if you're going desktop, you need to check your budget. And then... You need to buy within your budget the fastest video card that you can afford along with the uh, CPU. But you know the, the your budget really determines what you can get. Your level of sanity affects the damage you deal and take. The amount of XP you earn and the amount of specters you face. Oh, okay. So let's see if we got anything that can give us some sanity. some sanity you have a fifteen hundred dollar budget well <clears throat> now you need to find out do you want an amd build or do you want an nvidia build because what i would get what I would get, I would get a Ryzen. I think it's a Ryzen. I, th I think, is it a Ryzen 5 or a Ryzen 7? Well, you might just be able to look it up, but I would get a, a Ryzen 3700. And I would get a, a motherboard to go along with it. You might wind up spending probably around four hundred dollars and then i would look to get possibly a nvidia i mean you're probably gonna see some sales here soon an rtx 2070 i mean it's gonna eat some of your budget up dude and then you know you can go ahead and get the ram that'll go on the board and then get your case and Maybe a, a hard drive, a four gigabyte hard drive, and maybe a 512 SSD just for your operating system. That's what I would do. Especially if you're trying to, you know, run high FPS. A 2070 will really help you out. All right, take care, man. <laughs> Thanks. What is this? Chair? Oh, okay, just like Dark Souls, so I can travel. That'll take me... Take me back? But I didn't see anything in that old town. I mean, I'm pretty sure I came from the old town. And then I can meditate. And if I meditate... Surely it would give me some energy back, right? All right, it gave us some back. And it didn't matter about the creatures that were here because we haven't beaten anything on this, I guess this level. And creepy looking plants, man, they got teeth.
Press LB to parry. Yeah, I figured that out already. Well, they definitely got the blood in here. Now, I don't know where I'm supposed to be going, only that the person told me that th there's a creature that walks on all fours and he wants his liquor back. I wonder if I can shoot that for me. Now that was a little too close. Look at those creatures inside the trees. gonna move and another one up here What kind of creature is that right there? Will those plants bite me? Okay, I can't I can't do anything. That's a big wall. So not even uh shouldn't even waste any bullets. Well there's another one of those creatures. I was a goner. Like we picked up some more food. So, so far we're just going north.
not those things again. We might as well just go ahead and kill them. Stamina. <laughs> like little piranha, man. To get enough of them on you, they'll just kill you. Going up some steps. Want to run into a big boss monster or something? Oh, look at that! Is that what they're talking about? Look at it, top left corner. Oh man, what? Okay, I saw some up here. Let's leave him alone for now. Can I do anything? What is this? Gazebo? Hold LT to sneak. I probably need to find out what that creature is over there. Ooh, we got a save point or something. Okay, I'm not even going to meditate because all those creatures will come back. But what I will do is break up all these vases. Oh, he doesn't see me. I'm sneaking in the open. Hmm. That was interesting. Because when I was sneaking and I, you know, I stood up, he wouldn't, she wouldn't slash him. Oh, is that, is that the canister thing right over there? I wonder if that's it. Yeah, he's guarding it. And that's the wagon. Rombie's musket. Maybe an upgrade for the gun, possibly? Oh, yeah. And maybe we should put some power on this thing. Like some fire. Okay. Regenerate health over a short period of time, right? So I think we should What's this over here? Let's see what that is. I think we should fight that never mind. Too close, too close. We're gonna go fight that green creature. shot him okay I think we're clear okay here is that mo all right there's the monster there's the faces I'm going to shoot this guy once and run Kill this creature. 
I mean, I know I can't approach this thing, like, and talk to it. That usually doesn't work in a, in a demon type game. All right, I'm just gonna slash him. Damn thing, it's scary. Working. What is it waiting on? Oh, I can talk to it. Only the exalted may enter. So I'm not exalted enough. It was gonna slash me. All right, so do I mess around on the level some more? Just trying to find some things to kill and to like, you know, get high enough? I'm not sure. Let's see if we can make our way over there then. Chest. Oh, shoot. What do you do? Call his buddy over here? So I, I roll past him and then slashed him in his back. I don't want to fight one of those things again. It's probably inevitable that I do. another one okay I can try and do what I done like let him attack roll past oh, that's not working And I can go back and like respawn all these creatures, but I don't want to do that. Not want to 
want to do that. Hey, I, got, I think I have something in here in my inventory. Let's... Saw something about generating health over time. We can use the Lazarus flower. Let's use that. Guess we have to equip it. We'll equip it here for just one second and then we'll go ahead and use it. So it gives us 30. Okay. Guess it's better than nothing. Pretty long demo. That plant looks awful suspicious. gotta find the right one to break and then they'll open which it's right there Top right so I gotta find a way to come around I don't see anything I'm trying to just look up above this thing because it like sends out a shockwave and I don't want to be by it when it does it. Ooh, what is that? Time it, gotta time it. I'm surprised this game doesn't have like little traps for you to walk on and be like, oh, you know, minus five points, you stepped on a trap, you know, or you're stuck and it just sucks all your energy out. Got a house going on over here. What is that? Bottom right corner. Oh, can't be good. Can't be good. Probably outrun it. Oh, shoot! Did he walk on his own poison? I guess not. It's not gonna hurt him. Please don't run out of bullets. One bullet left. Oh 
What the? What? Oh, no. Let me just run and get rid of this dude. I can't fight that guy right now. Maybe he went back. I'd much rather fight the tree thing. Come on, you nasty looking. Come on, you nasty. Come on. Come on, I know you can come up steps. <laughs> Woo! Got you, you sucker. Oh, FXDY, he's asking uh, one last question. Do you know what the Fortnite settings, high res texture or something? I don't know. Or I need to turn it off or let leave it on. And thanks, I bought online 2080 with Ryzen 7, 16 gigabyte of RAM. I'm going to save money for 32 and water cool. Okay. You know the 30s are, 30 series is coming out, right? I have got 500 in my budget for free from family. All right, all right. If it works, bro. No, I don't have a build on how to build a um, a video on how to build a computer, but it's it's pretty simple though. I mean, I may make one. I mean, there's a lot of them on YouTube that you can look for. I mean, it's fairly simple if you take your time. But as far as the high res textures, I'm not sure on Fortnite because I haven't played it in a long time. It's probably been about a month or so. Okay, I think we were here. Yeah, we were over in this area. What's all the bubbly down there? That's where he was spitting up, right? Surely it'll disappear. Surely. things <sighs> looks like a boar of some kind oh man there he is there he is Freaking need it. Just what I need. I'm dead. I am freaking so dead. I am so dead. Dude got a shield too. Oh, 
on, eat. I'm gonna go ahead and break this. So at least I got that road open up there. So, man, this is, <laughs> this is rough, man. I mean, I guess I could go up there and try and fight this thing. I don't think I'm gonna do. He got too many people with him. I can't, can't risk it. But I can't kill that. Come on. <laughs> All right, so the stream has been going on for 53 minutes, almost approaching the hour mark, and that's where I'm going to end it. So, I'm going to go ahead and try to fight this guy. Oh, oh man, what a cheat! good thing about that is that I opened that one spot up over there and I can go right to him did it take in any of my inventory let's check no everything is still here so that's a good thing let's go ahead and head over that way hey what's up with that is it because I broke that one over there I think there was something over here that I couldn't get trying to parry but look how fast he's, he's using his powers man it's like one two i can't even get a shot at him by the time i parry and then try to attack him it, it's too late Gruesome, but there's got to be a way a pattern or something something I'm not doing. I don't maybe I'm not strong enough or oh, I don't know I mean I can handle these guys no problem These guys are no problem. The other ones are a problem. Oh, we got a new rifle. But we have no bullets. not better than what I got anyway. Hello. 
down there. Seven Acolytes. This is a demo, and eventually it's gonna get released. It's made by any developer. Any developer is, let's see, Merge Games. I think that's the publisher, but I don't know who the developer is. I don't know who the developer is. Just a publisher, just merge grants. Yeah, the developer is still running. And it should be out sometime soon. If you like this type of game, you might like it. The demo's out on Steam, just released about three hours ago. So go check it out, man. <laughs> 